If you took a bag of chips today that we sell in the supermarkets and you tried to make it with the process that we used back in 1946, you would have to charge about $25 because it would, it would take 10 times the amount of labor. When the company first started, uh, it was in a little barn, you know, very uh, labor intensive operation. It's kind of the opposite today. There were three or four of us working on unloading, and today it takes one person. First of all, the trailer comes in and backs up on a scale that weighs the truck. And then this scale lifts up with the tractor trailer on it and, and dumps the potatoes into the conveyor. We want to sell potato chips that are white, golden, golden white. So what we do is we pick out the ones that are a little off color. Years ago, we used to pick them out by hand. Today, we have this machine taking pictures of every chip that's on that conveyor. And then it communicates those pictures to thousands of little air jets. These little air jets shoot out the ones that are brown or you know sunburnt. Then the rest of them go on and, and go in, into the package. The first packages were formed, stapled, and put in a box by hand. And that was one of my mother's first jobs. When we run these packing machines today, the, the uh, packaging is coming in big rolls, and they put it on the back of this, this machine, and then as the chips fall down, the machine pulls the package down, and it, and it heat seals it. And it happens so fast, it's just like choo -choo 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 -choo, that we're doing 100 of these packages in every minute. When we first started in business, we would do about uh, five to 10 pounds of potatoes or potato chips in an hour. Today, with all the equipment and technology, we make between five and six tons of potato chips every hour.